Uniform. I'm Flight Sergeant Barry Tucker, D&D controller here at uh, Swanwick, and I've been a D&D controller now since 2008. For a pilot who has infringed on controlled airspace or thinks they might have done, the best thing to do would be, if they know the position, then call the air traffic unit that is in charge of the airspace so that they can deconflict themselves. But if they're not sure, then call D&D on 121 decimal 5 as soon as possible. It's best to call early rather than later when you've gone straight past the aerodrome. That way we can deconflict with the air traffic unit to make sure that everyone can get on their way and the aircraft can exit the area as soon as possible. When an aircraft calls us, we have our auto triangulation system that will give us a very good fix on where they are at, as soon as they transmit. From that, we can provide a steer to give them the most expeditious routing outside of the area. Whilst we're doing this, we'll be liaising with the air traffic unit in charge of the airspace again so that we can deconflict any aircraft movements. At D&D, we recommend and request practice pans by anyone flying uh, GA pilots purely for their own training and for ours so that when the need arises someone infringes or is inside controlled airspace we can react as quickly and as efficiently as possible to help them. To start your practice pans all we need is or ask that the GA community perhaps dial up 121 five. They listen in for a few seconds just to make sure that a, a real emergency is not ongoing and then just go straight into practice pan call or request your training fix, whatever it is that you feel you need to train best for you.